Praxis Prepper. Hey everybody, this is Praxis, and in this video we're talking about the day 19 episode of Praxis Prepper Alien Invasion. We're going to talk about some of the discussion points and topics brought up in the episode, and at the very end I'm going to share with you guys a sneak peek of what's happening next time on the series, so make sure you stick around for that. But before any of that, if you haven't seen the day 19 episode, here's a link somewhere, you can click on it so you know what we're talking about before we talk about it. Hold on a moment. Okay, we'll jump right in, but first I want to make sure I thank someone who helped to make tonight's episode possible. If you're not familiar, the only reason that I'm able to do these Alien Invasion episodes, and I've been generally improving the quality of my entire channel, is from the generous support of people just like yourself, who for as little as $1 a month have been uh, going to patreon.com slash practice prepper, there's a link down below, and helping to keep all this stuff going. In addition to that, they also give themselves guaranteed access to every single Alien Invasion episode, independent of whether or not we're at full funding, uh, so they'll always get two episodes every month. Uh, on top of that, they also get uh, access to behind-the-scenes content uh, and ways of participating in the series and even appearing in some of the episodes. So if you want access to all that stuff, or if you just want to help keep all this stuff going, which would be very much appreciated, there's a link down below, patreon.com slash prepper. You can go there and help out have all this stuff keep going. And the person I wanted to make sure that I thanked for uh, jumping on board and helping out with this in the past couple weeks is the host of Let's Talk About Prepping. Uh, he's a new uh, startup a YouTube channel. I checked it out recently as a good personality, uh, you know, seems pretty knowledgeable. I'd encourage you to check him out if you haven't already because, uh, you know, he seems like he has a lot to say and he's not an asshole. And those are two good things. So let's, enough about that. Let's talk about tonight's episode and a big thank you to ethical preparedness. Obviously, he did the bulk of the work on this episode. I did kind of the opening of it, which, you know, transitions into his bit uh, and, you know, some of the special effects for him. But, uh, you know, this is an EP episode. And thank you very much. If you're not familiar with EP's channel, first, how the hell did you find out about my channel? Because <laughs> he has a much more well-known channel than, my, than I do. But if you're not, for some weird reason, uh, familiar with ethical preparedness, make sure you check out his YouTube channel because he, he's a police officer. He's very knowledgeable, uh, and he's very ethical, as, as you might expect. <laughs> so I'd highly recommend you check out his content. Um, but he put in a lot of work on this. I want to thank him very much for doing that. And the primary, I guess, lessons that I'm drawing from this episode uh, are really the idea of like the non-sexy, non-exciting parts of prepping. And that's not like a, a hit against ethical preparedness, you know, that you're not sexy. But like the idea that uh, the topics that he brings up are the things that don't get people excited usually. Gardening, seed starting, you know, grinding wheat to make bread and stuff. You know, in fact, it was ethical preparedness that once told me that if you put a thumbnail of a gun in your, you know, as a thumbnail for your video, you're going to get way more hits. And he, he'll oftentimes like outline the, the outside uh, edges of his gun. Uh, and... You know, that's because it's more exciting. People think that's, that's amazing. In fact, last last time, the, did you guys recall the last uh, companion episode? There was that young woman who was a thumbnail. That, that video got twice as many hits. Some people complained that it was like clickbait, but honestly, if you're just clicking on guns and boobs, that's not my problem. <laughs> you know, I, maybe you should be clicking on other things other than those, those two topics. I don't know. But for whatever the reason, uh, there's a, a lot of attention paid to sex and violence and guns and all that kind of stuff. Uh, and, you know, in the preparedness community, oftentimes people neglect things like gardening, baking bread, grinding grain, all that kind of thing. What are some other things that you think are things that other people neglect when they're talking about prepping? Uh, you know, what it, you know, in this episode, we talk about, you know, the bread and the gardening and everything. But what are some other things you think maybe aren't that exciting, but are just as important as all that, but oftentimes they just get kind of shoved to the back, you know, relegated to you know, nothingness really, because, you know, they're not action packed and they're not exciting and everything like that. I'd love to hear your thoughts about the things that you think people miss out on because they're a little bit boring. And that might, again, sound like a slight against ethical preparedness, like ethical preparedness. He has the boring episode, but it's not at all. It's really important. I, I don't find it boring. I find it engaging. But, uh, but I think a lot of people just, you know, they don't get drawn to it because it's not action packed. So I'd love to hear your thoughts in the, in the comments below about what are some things that you think get really, you know, ignored. That's it. Uh, and let's go to a clip from what's happening next time on the series. The The situation by, for my character continues to evolve and develop, and it's about to kind of go off in a new direction now. So we'll see what happens. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Okay, great. Thank you. Yep, just keep an eye out 
for me or for us. I'm not sure if he's going to be coming with me or not. Oh, that's good little, that yeah. fine little stuff burns really well. Um, I was able to make contact with the people at that hospital again. Oh, yeah. They, they said that... Please subscribe and tune in every Friday at 4.30 New York time for a new video. And if you'd like to support this channel, you can do so both through Patreon or PayPal.